hi guys so today i'm here with another video reviewing esteline sunscreen esteline hey right there esteline sunscreen okay so this particular sunscreen brand esteline is actually from dr rochelle yes it's um a byproduct or should i say a subsidiary or a baby product of dr rochelle and i know a lot of you guys out there don't particularly like dr rochelle i'm saying this as a result of the videos the many videos i've seen on tiktok um tiktok girlies aren't really fan of dr rochelle although when their vitamin c um line came out a lot of people were rushing getting it but later they realized it wasn't the best after all so um this is going to be my first um sunscreen when it comes to my face okay for my body i use nivea usually when i'm going to be out for long going to the pool and all of that and i don't usually use it on my face because it's the it's the spray version the nivea spray version um sunscreen and so again um treating dark spots as a result of hormonal acne um in skincare i realize it's important to always have sunscreen because if you don't it's like just wasting your efforts and you know doing a cost 90 job for you Ghanaians out there who understand what i mean cost 90 and so <laughs> again i was looking for a budget friendly um, sunscreen that would not really leave a white cast on my face because a lot of sunscreens out there leaves white cast i mean that's what um, most sunscreens are known for and usually to get the ones that do not leave a white cast they're usually expensive you know like high end and all of that I'm talking about black girl sunscreen black girl sunscreen is like 300 and sorry 250 ghana cds i mean I'm a, I'm a regular girl in ghana i don't have that money to spend on sunscreen right so i just needed something that was affordable and yet will not leave me with a white cast which is like almost impossible to get but i went to my um neighborhood uh, cosmetic shop to get sunscreen and the girl introduced Dr. Rashaw to me, I mean, I had already done my review. I'm the type of person when I'm going to buy a product, especially a skincare product, I watch reviews, TikTok, read about it, so on and so forth. And so for Dr. Rashaw, it was completely out of, you know, of the question. And she introduced me to this, right? And I was like, okay, I don't think I've seen this before. Um, you know what? I'll get back to you. So I quickly went to check reviews and on TikTok, people are saying good things about it, you know? Um, this is Esteline Ultra Light Hydrating Invisible Sunscreen. It says instantly repairs and protects and protects against um, signs of aging. And from what I saw on TikTok, it was really like good to be true. And I mean, it's affordable. I got it for what 55 Ghana cities, and this is for 100 grams. Okay, that is 3.52 ounces yeah um people were using it and it wasn't really giving them white cast i was like is this real because i know most most sunscreens out there leave a white cast and for a product like this which is affordable and leaves no white cast i'm like okay why are people buying black girl sunscreen and not this because right we get the black girl sunscreen because it's made for dark skin it doesn't leave white cast and all of that and this is spf 80 this is SPF 80 PA triple plus. So I read a bit about the PA triple plus. Um, so when you look here, there's PA plus plus plus. All right. I read about it and they were like, the more the plus signs, the more effective the product is going to work. Right. So the triple plus is like excellent, very good for any sunscreen that has triple plus. I was like, okay. Um, so. This is not my first time using it i got this um about a week ago right and i've been using it every day i'm really impressed with the results i mean with the finishing and all that um so let me just right there 
this is how it looks again i love the packaging it's really cool so they say sunscreen is what two fingertips uh, two fingers <laughs> did i say fingertips two fingers so, okay so there you go right so this is just um a swatch right just so you see what i mean all right so i'm using the two on one side of my face just so you see how effective it is at leaving low white cast so blending that in blend 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 ouch okay. alright I mean usually the two is supposed to be for all the face but just to show you that this product really leaves no white cast I'm using two fingers on one side of my face did you see that? can you see that? do you see any white cast on my face between this side of my face and this side of my face there's absolutely no difference you can't even tell i've applied sunscreen did you see that like are you not amazed just no look at that do you see any white cast absolutely zero white cast i mean compared to my review of those lunas vitamin c face cream you see how white my face was just take a minute to look at my face okay no white cast whatsoever if you do not believe me let me just do the side of my face okay that's a lot I'm not editing this video i'm not pausing to go and edit it and come back to you i'm doing it right here so that you see for yourself that this video is unedited uncut and it's raw raw okay give it a minute to sink in do you see white cast absolutely no white cast like I'm impressed I'm amazed I mean this is my first sunscreen and I can't even complain because I watch videos I see a lot of people complain about how sunscreens are leaving them with white cars blah 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 and I can't relate can your sunscreen ever no look at that no white cast zero white cast all thanks to estelene hydrating sunscreen and it's really oil free like i don't feel greasy i don't even feel like i put on something like it's light it's it's the best if you're looking for sunscreen to use you're a newbie to skincare you need sunscreen just go for this i'm not even, i'm not kidding you and mind you i'm very oily like super oily and this product is perfect no white cast i'm trying to show you my face for real so that you see that there's no white cast no white cast do all to subscribe if you haven't subscribed to this channel share this video comment down below and go buy estaline sunscreen is the best i do know they have the tinted version um that one is brown in color this one is blue right um i'm not really sure about the tinted version um i just feel like i mean in africa climate change right now like temperatures are crazy I sweat every day and so getting a tinted sunscreen to me i feel like it's not really going to be the best because if i should clean my face with my handkerchief it's going to be a mess right so i'll just say start with this first and then eventually if you want the tinted version then that is fine but i'm really happy with it i'm really happy with this product i'm not gonna lie it's wonderful no white cast. I'm 
amazing it makes me think that perhaps people are bashing doc, um, dr rachel for nothing because i mean if this product from dr rachel is this amazing then i don't know maybe i should try some of their products i'm thinking of getting their um arbutin and uh, cinnamon serum especially for the dark spots just to lighten it up nothing crazy i'll try and get that sometime within this year and definitely um do a review on it do you see that no white cars it's amazing and i used four mind you i used four fingers two here two here which is not supposed to be so because usually it's supposed to be i think two fingers or three fingers of sunscreen and then you're done but i used four and in spite of that no white cast that should just let you know how amazing this product is it's amazing it's 55 ghana cds it's from dr shell dr rachel sorry <laughs> Because if you check their website, you realize that it's actually the same company that does Dr. Rochelle that also does this product. I love it. I, I just hope with time, they don't mess it up, you know, because when a product is new, I mean, they put in all their best and it's new, it's amazing. And then months or years down the line, they do what? Rebranding, reformulation. Please, please, please. Do not do any of that to this product. I love it as it is. This oily skin African girl, love it as it is. Do not reformulate, do not rebrand, do not improve anything. Because I don't want anything that will mess with the formula and leave me a white cast or... I don't know. I just, I really love it. So, if you're thinking of getting it, please run and get it. Alright? I love it. Don't forget to subscribe, like this video, comment down below, and share my videos to your friends. Thank you so much. See you next time on another review video. Bye.